Hey guys, what's going on? I know a lot of you have been requesting some G10 videos and uh, don't have any orders for any knife scales in just yet. Don't have any knives that need work yet. Uh, but those videos are coming in the future. Right now, I'm going to supplement that with uh, something I was wanting to work on. I just have a spare piece of G10 that I'm not going to use. Let me turn down the volume on the music a little bit. Uh, not really a big fan of the red G10. So I uh, have a little design drawn up. I'm going to try, I'm going to try <laughs> and make a a uh, knuckle self-defense tool, something like that. But I'm really a big fan of some of the aluminum and titanium versions people are making as keychains, the little uh, knuckle duster style self-defense tools. So I got the idea the other night of making one out of G10. Now this is. 1 8 inch G10, it would be a lot better if I had some quarter inch. But, like I said, this is going to be my first attempt at this, kind of a prototype deal, uh, just to see how easy this will be to do, and uh, it's something different and fun. I also have a guitar pick on there. <laughs> I have no idea how well fiberglass is going to respond to metal guitar strings. Uh, so, don't know if that's going to work out, but I, I would like to try that as well. But today we're going to be concentrating on this design right here. Don't need all that excess G10, so I'm about to cut it off. All right, suiting up here, I just have on a long sleeve cotton button up. Easy to dust off and get the uh, fiberglass all off of it. I'm wearing gloves. Fiberglass doesn't affect everybody. However, it makes me break out in a rash. So I'm going to cover up the best I can. Now, I don't have any dust masks, but as you see behind me, our shed door is wide open, well ventilated, and when I get to the actual sanding process, I have a shop vac that I'll have right by my working area that'll suck up all the dust. So that should be sufficient. All right, I'm about to suit up and make myself look like a bandit. Don't have gas, if you don't have any kind of dust masks, these bandanas work just fine. G10 smells pretty interesting when you're grinding on it. That's what I got so far. Let's see how this turns out. Be faster. Pretty good so far. Made a little uh, tip on it, kind of. Uh, kind of uneven, but we'll see how it goes. Still gotta do the hole for it.
All right, guys, here it is, my prototype. I call it the Knuck Off. <laughs> the Knuck Off 1. I said this is just a uh, prototype, just to see if I could make one. It's not bad. Got a little point going on there. Needs work. Um, kind of ran out of... Uh, a sanding bits, so here's how it would fit on my middle finger. Fairly comfortable. I need thicker G10. Like I said, this is not meant to just uh, go out and be ready. This is a prototype just to see how the shape would work, see how comfortable it is. Next time I'll probably mill this hole out up higher so that you get more support back here in your palm. Or I'll just make it longer next time. Yeah, not bad. You use it on your middle, on your uh, index finger. It's not as comfortable that way. So yeah, not bad. It's pretty cool. I need to uh, drill a hole for the keychain. Yeah, guys, just wanted to uh, see if I could do this, and uh, I'd like to make some more in the future when I get some more G10, drop some more designs. Yeah, let me know what you guys think, if you think I should uh, continue working on these things. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed. Stay safe, stay sharp, and God bless. Sherman614, peace.